guys and welcome back to another vlog so today i'm gonna be just bringing you guys along with me like i always do i have to run a couple of errands i have to go and drop off um packages off at usps because i ordered nico and i swimsuits and board shorts for our staycation next month for my birthday and none of it fits i love that so i need to drop that off and then i have a hair appointment and Nico and my mom both texted me saying that there there's like tons of traffic for whatever reason So I need to like hurry up and get on the road. So I'm not late Kyron and Drix are both at the sitter today because Kyron is on spring break I had every intention on bringing Kyron with me, but he's like, I don't want to come with you to your hair appointment I'm like, oh, okay so he's there. So we'll go and pick him up later. Pick them up later I have a couple of um, brand videos that I need to shoot. So let's go and you guys, I finally got my silver play button in the mail, and that is all thanks to you guys. Okay, I am ready. I just have to smell good, you know? Can never forget to smell good. That is very important. Also, if you follow me on TikTok, you would have saw the mess that Drix got into with my Sol de Janeiro body cream, my favorite, favorite one. He literally spilt it, well, he got into it and spread it all over this room, so... My whole room smells like this, which I'm not complaining about, but this thing was full and it's like almost empty now. Love that. Okay, we got my phones, my bag, my iced coffee. Turn off the lights. I literally get cold everywhere I go, so I always have to bring a jacket. Okay, let's go. Okay, you guys, I decided that I'm not going to go to the post office first. I'm going to just go straight to my hair appointment because the traffic is already bad and I didn't even leave my city. And look, look at this. It's already like at a standstill and this is not normal at all. So I don't know what the heck is going on. So yeah, we're going to go straight to my hair appointment, which is literally on the other side of the island. Um, so yeah, we're going to do that. It's a beautiful drive though. I filmed it one time on here and um, it's just it's a really nice drive, but um, not when you're in traffic. So we're going to just go to um, the post office later. Yeah, look, everybody's turning around already. And N Nico told me, he's like, don't go this way. Don't go this way. But my dumb forgot and I made the turn to go over here and I'm already here okay I am so freaking hungry so I'm just going to a drive-thru to get me something to eat really quick hi um can I get the double boat uh, double smoked bacon sandwich and then can I try um your iced lavender cream matcha thank you wow this driveway driveway this drive through is very like high tech like you can see there's a screen and you can see the person that you're talking to on there I've never seen that before and please don't come for me for going to Starbucks you guys I, like seriously i i know i understand but like that is like the literal literal only drive through around here and i'm running late okay i haven't came here to starbucks in so so long like i literally make my coffee at home but i wanted to try that lavender matcha thing because i heard it's really good yeah and this is the only drive through and i'm gonna be late if i go anywhere else so please don't come for me okay just please i've been making changes you guys i really have i barely go to mcdonald's i barely um even go to what is it called um starbucks i literally rarely ever go i am so hungry i am like shaking because i'm not hungry right now your videos i went oh. to pass for my hair after i saw that she oh does her hair. okay yeah i'm actually going to see her right now oh, did you see my hair at the beginning of this month? oh yeah <laughs> thank you thank you have a great day. thank you you too oh she was so sweet she said that she went to go to my hair girl because she saw one of my videos and that's where i'm going right now oh going the wrong way going the wrong way it is such a beautiful day here it is the sun is shining bright and i'm happy because i'm it has been so rainy and just like windy lately just not the vibe you know like it was good while it lasted but i'm just over the cold and like i like the cold at nighttime but i, I don't really care for the cold in the daytime but i am not looking forward to the heat in the summer because that's intense I love I'm driving down here in Kaneohe because you can just see like all the mountains like look, look at how beautiful that is it's just so 
so nice so this is the east side of the island i live in the central side of the island so i don't get like the nice views you know i live um like in the middle of the island the middle of everything okay where did i put the straw now i swear i am like what the heck i just had the straw and where did it go now it couldn't go far okay i just want to do a taste test and see how this this tastes i'm really annoyed where the heck is my straw I heard it, it tastes like cereal and I love matcha. Oh, this is good. This is really good. You can definitely taste the lavender in it and I'm not a huge lavender girl, but this is really good. It's like, it's sweet, but it does taste like cereal. And the bacon, the double bacon sandwich is just top tier. It's just so good. Like the bacon is very crispy, you know? Mm -hmm. We just got to my hair appointment. Look how nice it is. Like I was saying, wait, let me make sure I did not lock my keys in my car. Hold on. You guys know I am literally so famous for that. Okay, no, I didn't lock it. I have my keys. Okay, I am done. She does an amazing job. Every single time I come to her, I always leave obsessed. Look how much brighter my hair looks. Just, I just needed it refreshed for sure. And we actually did like a full, I don't know if it's balayage, but like she does like baby lights, but we did it like some underneath here too as well. So like when I wear my hair up, it's not so dark. Um, but yeah, so if you are on Oahu, Pash is amazing. I don't even know if she... I'm pretty sure she takes new clients, but she's busy. Like she's booked and busy. But um, yeah, she does such an amazing job. Like, look at that. I'm just admiring my hair right now. <laughs> okay, so now we are gonna go finally to the post office and then I have to pick my kids up already, like in a couple of hours. So I'll probably try to go home and get a little bit of things done. Like, I don't even know. I feel like my whole day is like kind of gone already, but um, we'll see. And driving home is just as nice and whenever it rains all these mountains you can always see waterfalls so that makes it really pretty but today is a very sunny day so no waterfalls for us to see okay we're at the post office I got the two bags that I need to return I don't think I'm gonna film too much in there just because it's like a very small and intimate you know we'll see I love how convenient and easy that was, right? It's so easy. So now that we've got that done and out of the way, we are gonna go home. I think we have like about an hour until I have to pick the boys up. That's where my real job begins, you know? Yeah, we have about an hour, so I'm gonna go home. Just try to like get a couple of things done. I don't know how much I will be able to. Oh, you know what? I actually might stop off at the store really quick um, because I have to fa uh, film a brand video and I need to get like kiwis. I don't even know if my store sells kiwis. Like, I don't know. But we're, let's, let's just do that so I can get that out of the way so that I don't have to do it tomorrow or maybe I could go tomorrow. I don't know. Let us let me just drive there and see how I feel. We came to Safeway. I just need to get one thing. I'm not going to get like a bunch of things. I'm literally just going to go in for fruits. I need to get something to make like to use my juicer for this brand video. Why does it have to be so busy right now? Okay, I need to get some kind of fruit like but there's only like basic fruits here. Like what the hell am I going to juice? Like a pineapple? I don't know. Um, I really don't know. Like, we don't even have kiwis here. I told you guys. Like, I don't even know what the heck we're supposed to, like, what we're supposed to juice. Like, literally, I don't know, maybe pears? Maybe I'll do, like, a pear juice kind of thing. Like, that's the only thing that I can think of. Maybe I could do, like, grapefruit or something. Here's a grapefruit. I've literally never bought, brought grapefruit in my life. I think we're gonna just stick... Oh, wait, I think I see a kiwi. <gasps> I see kiwis. 
There, we have kiwis. Okay, I'm gonna get that. Okay, we got kiwis and pears. I hope this works. We're just gonna go on a, we're gonna go on a walk, so just um, go scooter that way. Okay, we're gonna go on a walk. I have these clips in my hair because <laughs> my flyaways are a little crazy right now, but yeah, we're just gonna go around the block. Okay, you guys ready? Oh, oh, you okay? You okay? This wagon is not the sturdiest. I got it from Amazon. You can definitely tell the quality of it. Let me show you guys. So this is what the wagon looks like and the tires and whatever. But it's not the sturdiest, honestly. Sit down, baby. Sit down. Okay. We just did our yard the other week. A lot of places are dead in the yard. I don't know how because it has been raining so much here. I want to play in the front. No, 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 no. 49ers, That's not the 49ers, dude. That's the Chargers. This um, wagon is really nice because it folds up like this. Whoa. Like this. That's the one thing I like about it. So it's really like convenient and lightweight. And it comes with the cover. This thing was a hundred bucks, so you guys kind of you get what you pay for because the really good ones are like almost a thousand. I'm gonna let them like play for a little while. Then we're gonna go inside and eat dinner and all of that. If that ball goes over, it's gone forever. Good catch. What do you want? You want the ball? Karin, share with him, please. No. Oh, you okay? You okay? Okay. <laughs> boys will be boys, you know? It is the next day. Don't mind me, I have not gotten ready for the day yet. So I just made my coffee. Um, right now what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be prepping our dinner because I'm gonna be making pot roast in the crock pot for the first time. I do not know how to do that, but I'm just hoping for the best. Um, I'm get, After I'm done doing that, I'm gonna um, take the boys where they need to go and then I'm gonna do some housework and then just get um, some work done because I have a lot to catch up on but I have to get ready before I do all of that too so yeah I'm just um I have to prep for the pot roast um I have to like cut the onions and all of that and sear the roast I don't know how that's gonna go because if you know me I'm not the best cook so let's hope for the best Okay, now we're just putting the onions and the carrots and making them caramelize. <laughs> I don't even know how to say that word right. And then yeah, we're gonna put all of that in to the crock pot with the rolls. So, so far so good, we'll see. So it says to do like four minced cloves of garlic, but that is just like not enough garlic. Okay. Okay, and I think that is ready to go and cook in the uh, crock pot for about eight hours and then I have to like make like a, a sauce thing after so that's the part I'm actually scared of. Putting in the crock pot, setting it to low and we'll cook that for eight hours and 20 minutes. I was gonna do it on um, low for four to five hours but I feel like it just tastes better when it's like a long process you know what I mean like to soak in all the flavor okay so the boys are out of the house and I got ready for the day so now I'm gonna clean up because I cannot get things done and be productive if I feel like my house is not like up to par you know so I'm gonna like vacuum my house and then I'm also gonna just wipe things down and then after that I really need to get like on it with work because it's almost 12 o'clock already and I've just been like scrolling on my phone getting a little things done but not much and I need today to be productive because tomorrow I have like appointments all day so today is my day to get caught up. If you're wondering why 
why I'm pushing so hard with this vacuum. It's because the way that the carpet is, like the, the texture and all like the, the, the design, it doesn't just smoothly go over it um, with the vacuum. So that's why I have to like put some elbow grease. So that's why it looks a little weird. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Love you. Nico's on night shift, so this morning he got home at like 4.30 and then he'll sleep and then he'll go run his errands and then he'll come back home and he gotta go back to work. And he does that every two weeks, like two weeks he's on day shift where he works in the daytime and then he switches to night shift and then it's two weeks night shift. So it's a crazy schedule. He works seven days a week. So that's why when everyone's like, where's Nico? He's working, that's where he is. being productive today but I really like don't feel like I'm being that productive honestly god this smoothie can get so thick sometimes but this is my weight gain smoothie I talked about this in my other um, one of my other videos so I'm gonna drink this this will fill me up and then I need to eat lunch but I still have like four videos that I need to film for TikTok and I'm like god I just I don't know I'm like kind of not in a funk today, but I just like don't have like high energy. Oh, I want to show you guys some of my outfits that I got for um, like our staycation that we're doing next month. I feel like I'm like being so extra about this staycation, but you know what? Like I don't, we don't go on that many staycations. And even though like we're staying on the island, it's still like a vacation to us. You know, like we're, we don't always go to the beach. Like we, even though we live in Hawaii, we rarely go to the beach. So um, I want to take like cute pictures. I'm going to vlog the entire time for YouTube. Um, so I just wanted to get like some cute outfits. So let me show you what I ordered. We did have to return a couple of things. So I don't have like everything in the mail. But I want to show you guys like what I got so far. Let me show you the things that I got. These are like bikinis, cover-ups. And then I also got the boys a few things. The first thing that I got. I actually bought this from my friend Marissa. It's brand new with tags. It's a... Um, Meshki One Piece. If you know Meshki, Meshki is like a really like good brand for bikinis and just anything. But and it's like cut out like that. You see, so cute, right? I love that. And I think I'm gonna wear it with um these pants. So I know it's kind of hard to see the whole thing, but this is like the design. I got these from Pretty Little Thing, and it's like silk. It's cute, right? It's giving vacay vibes for sure. And then I also got this. Um, one piece for my friend Marissa. If you don't know, Marissa has her own like thrifting um, or reselling business. But these were hers, so I, she she didn't even wear, wear them, I don't think. I know she didn't wear the meshy one. I'm not sure if she wore this, but she's one of my good friends, so I trust her. But this is from Riot Swim, and it, Riot Swim is like an excellent bikini line. Um, and look at the sides. The sides are so freaking cute. I'm obsessed. So this is like a one piece as well. And then... I'm going to use it with this um, cover-up, this zebra cover-up, but it's actually not black and white. It's the this exact brown, literally, almost exactly the same, and it's navy blue. So I thought that was really cute, so I'm going to just like wear that around my waist, you know? And then, okay, so this is a bikini I really invested on. This three-piece bikini set was like almost $300, but you know what? Um, it's a very good brand. It's Monse Swim. And I just had to buy it because I'm like, it's so nice. And when you invest in good bikinis, it'll last. So, you know, that's what I'm going to try to convince to myself, you know? So it's just a, a two-piece bikini. It's kind of hard to tell the color on camera, but it's like, it's the color is buttercream. And that's exactly what the color looks like. And it's this, I don't know what kind of material this would be, but you guys can kind of see, you know, it's like a very soft material but look how pretty that is it's so nice and then i got it um just with bikini bottoms and then i got the sarong what did, what do they call this yeah they call this a sarong we in hawaii we call it a pareo um but i know i don't 
I know my non-Hawaii followers are gonna be like, what the hell is a pareo? But that's what we call it. But a sarong. So it's the same thing and yeah. So I thought that, that was very cute, very aesthetic. And then I also got another bikini set from Frankie's Bikinis. And Frankie's Bikinis is another really good brand. But I had to return the top because the top was too small. So I'm waiting for the correct size to come in. But this is the print of it. So cute, right? It reminds me of um, dishes. <laughs> like, you know, like those people who have like dishes, like dishware. I don't know. But yeah, that's the print. And it's just like a triangle top. So that's what... What the bikinis that I'm wearing for my staycation. I got we're gonna be there for four days So I was like, okay, I need like four bikinis and I got my four bikinis and then for Nico I also bought him like some new board shorts and stuff, but um, they were too small So I had to exchange that as well That one was from um, Ruka But for the boys I got them they already have board board shorts but you know, it's just fun like buying new things like when you're gonna go on vacation, it just is. You can't convince me otherwise. Um, so I got them both of uh, the same matching little shorts. Look how cute that is. And these are all from Binky Bro. I think Binky Bro has really good prices for kids boy short, board shorts. They're 34 bucks and I think it's worth it. And then I got Kyren these brown ones and then it has like their little logo right there and then i got drixie these cute little neutral ones with the white on the side and then since we're gonna be in the sun so much i also got them rash guards so i got them a navy blue one the same one and then i got them brown ones as well so they could use these with their brown ones and these with the checkered ones and then I also ordered them a bunch of like new clothes and some board shorts from H&M. So I'm waiting for that to come in the mail as well. I'm just so happy that I ordered everything early, especially the fact that I had to like return them. So I gave myself enough time to order things just in case I had to return it. Because if I waited to the last minute like I normally do, I would be screwed because I would have no time to like exchange them for like a bigger price, you know? But yeah, that is everything that I got so far. I'm still waiting for some things to come in the mail for me as well. This staycation is for my birthday. So I needed to get like, you know, dinner outfits and whatnot. And I had ordered a dress from White Fox that I thought I was gonna love. But like the more that I look at it online, I'm like, I don't know if I love it that much, so. I'm on the hunt still for another dress, but I cannot find a certain dress. I want I want a white dress and I can't find it. I just can't find like the perfect white dress. And I need it to be like cute and fitting like the beach vibes kind of, you know, because we're literally staying at a resort on the beach. And the dress that I got is like pink, bright pink and orange. And I'm like, I feel like this just does not fit the vibe that we're going for. I feel like that's more like Fancy steakhouse dinner vibe, you know? Nico brought home lunch for us from Zippy's. And if you guys are not from Hawaii, you probably don't know what Zippy's is, but it's like local food. I mean, some American food, but like with a local fusion to it. I don't know how to explain it, but it is like an icon here in our state, an icon. And they even brought it to Vegas since Vegas is like the ninth island. Um, so yeah, let me show you what she got. Okay, so I got my favorite, which is a mini Korean fried chicken. And then, what did you get? Dude? Teriyaki hamburger steak. So bomb. And then, Nico always gets this li Lily Koi yeah. drink. He didn't get me an orange bang, but that's okay. Shut up! You can <laughs> We like to watch, like, cops or, like, uh, what is it called? Body cam, body cam footage. We yeah. watched the jail one. Yeah, but actually, well, I've been watching body cam footage. I love this blind. Yeah. I've been super into body cam footage. Okay, and then he got dessert. <laughs> he got these two chocolate center donuts. This is a flaky donut and a cinnamon doba. Danish. Danish. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard of a flaky donut before. It looks good, yeah. Because it flakes? Yeah, it's flaky. Oh. But it's good. 
It's like, uh, try it. No, I'm, I'm good. I'm full already. Okay, so I'm going to go and pick up Hendrix and Kyron right now. Hendrix is at the sitters. And then right after that, I have to like shoot over. Oh my God, this is really close. I have to shoot over to my grandma's house because that is where Kyron is. Kyron went golfing with my grandpa today and he just stayed at my at their house. Um, and then Ky we're gonna come back home. Um, Kyron's auntie is gonna be picking him up and they're gonna go to a family dinner. So it's just gonna be me and Hendrix tonight because Nico is on night shift. But at least we have my roast to, to eat, you know? I'm excited, it smells really good. I'm gonna show you guys, but it is looking and smelling delicious. So that's what we're gonna do. And I, I, did, I did get quite a few things done. Um, today I, even though I was feeling unproductive I got things done so I'm feeling good where's Kyron I know at home we gotta go pick Kyron up huh we gotta go pick Kyron up huh what did you do today I sleeping who's sleeping shh, shh. let me call Opa to say have Kyron ready to go because yeah. wait Kyron has a dinner Drix is gonna be so mad because Kyron's not gonna be home for dinner. They're like BFFs, even though they fight like cats and dogs. They they're brothers, you know. They love each other. Hello. Opa, um, I'm leaving Auntie Janai's right now. So can you, um, can Kyron, can he just run out? Bye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Bye. Say we'll okay, hi, Kyron. Okay. You put on your seatbelt. Did you have fun golfing today? Yeah. What did, like, did you do good? Yeah. Like, how good? Like, so, so good. So, 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 so good. Good. Good job. Bye, boys. Okay, thank you. Bye, boys. Say bye. Bye, boys. Bye, boys. <laughs> okay, so here is the moment of truth to see how the roast came out. It smells bomb. Oh, yeah, it looks good. Look at that, you guys. Looks bomb, right? I'm just packing Nico's lunch or dinner. Yes. And then I put in um, some Jap Japan candy. Oh my god, I love you. Say bye, Kai. Bye. Love you. Love you. He goes off to work again. Ah! Ah, scary! Ah! Ah! And me. Oh, it's you. And me. It's you. Okay, I'm not scared anymore. Okay, our daily playing outside activities are almost over. Kyron's gonna be going to dinner soon. Okay, Dixie had an accident and he wanted to take off and run really fa fast and away from mommy. And he got instant karma and fell down and got a strawberry. Yeah, look, who's that? Elfie, Christmas. Huh? Elfie. Elfie. Okay, there. Oh, better. I'm gonna play Play Doh. You wanna play Play Doh? Yes. Oh, goodness. Never ending. Okay, guys, it is like literally like two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Me and Nico and Hendrix both fell asleep on the couch because Kyron um, ended up sleeping at his aunt, uh, his grandparents' house. So yeah, I'm just gonna be doing um, my skincare now because I literally just got out of the shower. Nico is taking a shower now, and my skin has been like so dry lately but then also oily it's just definitely been like a combination of many things i've also been like breaking out a lot like not a lot but like more than usual and it's driving me crazy because i don't break out too much honestly and if i do it's Nothing like crazy, but that means that like something that I'm using is making me break out. That's normally what it is. Um, I have been wearing more makeup lately, so I'm thinking that's what it is, you know? 
but I'm still not gonna stop wearing makeup. So I guess I'm just gonna have to deal with the breakouts. Yeah, I'm really mad at myself for falling asleep early last, I mean, yeah, early last night because I had like a whole to-do list of things that I really needed to get done because I'm trying to get um, like a few videos out tomorrow that I was supposed to edit and I need to get that done. I also have a sink full of dishes, a crock pot full of sauce or like beef broth. I'm just sitting on my counter. That's so nasty, honestly. And it looks like I'm gonna be going to sleep with it on my counter because I'm so freaking lazy to do it. So a lot of people like don't realize that, like they think because they see like my cleaning videos on like that I post that I'm like the most cleanest person in the world and I'm human, okay? So I'm definitely not perfect. I <laughs> definitely fall asleep a lot and my house is a disaster and I wake up with a crazy looking house and it gives me anxiety. So, and I feel like a lot of people can relate to that because I know I'm not the only one. Tomorrow, I have to do my car registration because I never got like a registration renewal in the mail because I always will be on top of my things when it comes to that. I was like looking at my registration when I took my car in to get service and they're like, your registration is expired because I wanted to get a safety check. And I'm like, what? And so I have to get a failed safety check because you need a, a current registration in order to get a safety check. So I have to go do my registration tomorrow morning. After that, I have to go get another safety check, like a current one. Then I have to go to my bank and open up another bank account. I literally feel like I'm opening like bank accounts left and right. Like, I mean, it's a blessing, but still I'm like, okay, I think this is enough bank accounts. Tomorrow night, I have a social media call for New Skin. So if you guys don't know New Skin, um, like I'm just a part of their team. Like, you know, that Lumi brush that I um, always use to cleanse my skin. Yeah, so I'm on a team full of amazing women in Hawaii and across America, but our small team in Hawaii. They asked me to do like a social media call just to give like some tips and tricks and I am not prepared for it. So I need to like really like sit down tomorrow for like an hour and like write down everything that I need to because I am somebody who needs to plan it out because if I don't, I'm going to be like a deer in headlights and be like, um, what? What am I talking about? I'm talking about nonsense and I'm gonna sound dumb. And I can't have that, you know? Also, I get asked like literally all the time where I get my lash serum. I get it from a place called Roderm. So all you have to do is Google Roderm and it'll pop up. If you do Roderm.com, it takes you to like some weird site and that's not what it is. So if you just do Roderm Latisse, L A T. T-I-S-S-E, it'll pop up. And that's where I order my Latisse, which is my lash serum. This is like the only lash serum that has made my eyelashes like this long and thick. I have tried many, many eyelash serums and just nothing works as good as it. As good as it. It looks like this. It's a very, very tiny bottle. It, this one lasts me, I would say, like a couple of months. At first, when you're trying to build your lashes, you have to use it twice a day, I believe. And then once you like get like to your achieved length and volume, you can go down to like just once a day, like at nighttime. But right now, my lashes are in the fallout stage and it's driving me crazy because they look very sparse. So I have been applying it morning and night. But I'm telling you, this will make your eyelash grow like weeds. Seriously, my mom, my mom naturally has super long lashes and she had to stop using this because this was like making her eyelashes like too long. Well, not too long. She just said like, oh, I don't need something as strong as that. So that's how she got me. She put me on this because she gave me hers. And I was like, oh my God, uh, obsessed. I have been repurchasing ever since. Another thing I wanted to show you guys before I go to bed, hold on. Okay, so this is something called the Renu Spa and I just got it. It just released like um, like a few weeks ago and I haven't used it yet, but I have some like loose skin on my stomach just like from, you know, being pregnant and whatnot. It's just like not the tightest. Um, that's what happens to your body when you have babies. Um, so this is used 
And this is not an ad, by the way, okay? Like, I bought this with my own money. But I just wanted to share with you guys my journey because I'm going to be trying to be consistent with it and use it five days a week, five minutes a day. And you just, you know, it looks like this. And you just massage it over, like, any problem areas. And it's supposed to, like, tighten and firm. And, and it can even lift. The before and afters for this is insane. Um, so I will let you guys know how it is before you buy it. I'm going to try to use it for like a month and then I will get back to you guys. But it's actually really cool because you can use this app on here. And this app like syncs with, with this and it'll tell you like kind of what to do. And it'll like you can set goals and all of that. So I'm going to try to do that right now. So you have to use this conductive gel and you put it on the area that you know that you're going to use you can use use it on your arms your abdomen your legs you know all that you cannot use this like on your neck or anything though or your face it's it's made for like the body just not like your your face and neck you know and you can even use this it's kind of like ultrasound gel um and you can even use it Jeez. you can even use this um just for like relaxation like you don't even have to do this for like aesthetic purposes. You can literally use it for relaxation. That's what I'm going to do right now. Okay, I just turned it on and I'm going to do it now. So do you guys hear that? That's like, it uses microcurrents. And this is, they use this a lot like in med spas, microcurrents to like help with like skin tightening, anti-aging and all of that. So yeah, you just like move it up and down. I don't even know if I'm doing this right because this is literally like my first time. But yeah, it literally sounds like, um an ultrasound honestly but it feels good too like i said you can use this um just for like massaging which i would not do but i mean personally i wouldn't do i'm i'm using this to get some results you know so before i go to bed i need to charge my toothbrush and then i need to also charge my lumi my lumi spa because they're both dead and these are like my two important devices so by tomorrow morning, they will both be charged and ready to rock. Okay, so I'm going to go to sleep now and I'm probably going to be ending the vlog here as well. I am truly going to try. I, I know I say this in like every single video, but I am truly trying to be more consistent on YouTube and post like these longer vlogs at least once a week. And I think that I'm doing a pretty good job. Um, I, It just took me to like took a little time for me to get in the swing of things just because I'm so used to filming short form videos like for TikTok and Instagram. Um, so I had to just get used to it for YouTube, but I feel like I, I am and I hope you guys are enjoying them. Okay, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.